always trying to win. I mean, that's our biggest goal is really to be on the top, stay on the top. Um, we don't mind being the hunted. We don't mind hunting. I mean, that's, that's just what you know, we want to do. We always want to be the best and, and come out on top. The one thing about the University of Texas is the athletes really work hard here in the classroom. It, nothing's given to them. They really have to work. And um, you know, they know really that athletics is second to getting that done. And you know, we as coaches, we push that. So they know that there is no practice, there's no competition, you know, until they are successful in the classroom. The support staff with the, you know, the training room, the medical, the uh, academic staff, everybody is so supportive and is willing to do whatever it takes for the athletes to be successful. So all you really have to do is fall in line and, and accept what's being given to you and work hard. And, um, you know, try not to be average, you know, try to really work hard at, at, um, at achieving the highest goal possible and, you know, it, it should work out. The great thing about it is I can't imagine any employers that wouldn't be excited to see somebody who is also competing very highly at the collegiate level and doing well nationally, but at the same time has really uh, worked hard in the classroom and proven to be one of the best students on this campus. Forget about the athletic side of it. I can't imagine that they would not have set themselves up pretty good to go off into the world once track and field is over. I've learned in coaching to have patience. So um, I'm excited, but I'm not, I, I want things to go slowly and go smoothly because um, it's a long season. We will go all the way through August if we're lucky. And um, so, you know, I'm, I'm excited, but um, you know, I just want to make sure that everything is in place before we really get going.